Omi and a Hellcat makes national news. Daily Druid Exotics finally reveals their new supercar. All of this on today's episode of Sinclair News. What's up everybody and welcome back to another episode of Sinclair News and happy Thanksgiving to those of you that celebrate it. Uh, it is Thanksgiving here in the United States of America and I am uh, still filming a video for you guys because this is breaking news. Uh, I'm going to put this up at probably noon as opposed to my regular upload time at 5. So if you're seeing this, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I hope you're enjoying this time with your family or however you choose to celebrate it. But we have a huge story today, but before we get into that, make sure you subscribe because if you subscribe, we are now 1,100 away from 20,000 subscribers and your chance to win a $100 Visa gift card and spend it wherever you want. You could buy your mom something for Christmas, you could buy a Whataburger, you could buy a new In-N-Out here in Texas, in Houston. Uh, There's a lot of stuff you can spend it on, so smash that subscribe button because it's free. On to the main first story. All right guys, so this is absolutely crazy. I woke up to a DM by my friend Wari Uzumake. He posts a lot of stuff with his Hellcat and uh, is a big Omi and a Hellcat fan himself. And he posted this crazy video of the actual Fox News picking up on this story and pretty much explaining everything that's happening to Mr. Omi and a Hellcat. So I will be quiet and roll this thing for you because I'm sure that is the whole reason why you guys are here. So. Enjoy the breaking news story from Fox News. YouTube celebrity is telling the online world he has been raided by the feds. He's well known for his fancy high-end cars and candid videos. His channel has half a million subscribers and his videos have been viewed 35 million times. But those pricey cars aren't sitting in his driveway anymore. Fox 29's Jeff Cole joins us live from the federal courthouse in Philadelphia with the story. Jeff. Shayna Omar Carrasquillo is a local man who appears to have hit it big on YouTube. But a raid of his New Jersey property by federal agents last week is likely, it may, strike big trouble for him. The sprawling home on the 100 block of Fox Chase Court, Swedesboro, almost appeared abandoned, with the shades down and no answer at the door. A far different look from what appears on YouTube, where homeowner Omar Carrasquillo shows off his collection of high-end cars. They um, had like bulletproof vests on and they had guns drawn and they were very slowly approaching the house next door. Wednesday, November 20th, and the appearance of great wealth collapsed sane neighbors when FBI agents seen here in cell phone pictures hit the place in an early morning raid hauling the cars away. They loaded them off one by one for the course of about four or five hours. They took all his cars? They took all the cars. Probably, probably 30 of them. It's unclear just what the feds are investigating. Their local offices declined comment Wednesday. But Carrasquillo, a 33-year-old YouTube sensation also known for web hosting, has clearly drawn the aggressive attention of investigators. In a brief phone conversation with Fox 29, a man claiming to be Carrasquillo refused to answer questions on the record. A source close to him tells Fox 29 he's being investigated for alleged tax evasion and copyright infringement but hasn't been charged. The source claims the feds also seized pricey jewelry and all the money in his bank accounts. A neighbor says she has not seen Carrasquillo of late but is concerned for his family. It's still scary and um, we're not sure what's going on. Um, I have um, a great deal of sympathy for his family. Um, and, and the children that he has. I, I hope that they're going to be okay through all of this. Now, a source close to Casquillo says he does not believe he's done anything wrong in the area of web hosting and streaming. As you've reported, he has spoken about the raid on YouTube and even shown the search and seizure documents. Omar Casquillo lives in the former home of ex-Philly shortstop Jimmy Rollins. 
Live in Center City at the Federal Court Building, I'm Jeff Cole, Fox 29 News. Now that is crazy that a YouTuber has made it onto the national stage of Fox News. Uh, I think the only other people to do that were like the Paul brothers. I'm pretty sure, not 100%, but that is crazy that they're picking up on the YouTuber story. But what do you guys think about that? Is it cool? Is it a little bit scary that now the mainstream media is getting into our hands and fingers? Me and Life Apollos so are gonna have some competition fighting on Fox News and CNN and everybody? Or what? Well, I don't know. It's because this is a new chapter for us. But I just want to hear what you guys have to say about this video. It's very interesting. It's very breaking. It just came out. And uh, I just want to know what you got to say. And that's all for that one. And let's go on to our second and final story today. It was Josh, you guys. He left his wallet. <laughs> he always leaves his wallet at home. So he owns all the cars. Yeah, we got his car. Give us his wallet. <laughs> That's amazing. The question is, is do we do a twin turbo already from the manufacturer, or do we go naturally aspirated V12? Like we're just driving by Wayne in the A12 super fast. How ridiculous is that car? So. I'll leave you guys off with that little bit of information. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Thank you for spending the time with me. It means a whole lot. I know you could be doing a whole lot of better things right now, but you're here with me. So go ahead, pat yourselves on the back. It's from me. Go smash that like button. And remember, watch the best and skip the rest. If you did like the video, please smash that like button, subscribe. If you're new to the channel, I'll see you in the next video.